you're an aspiring entrepreneur or maybe you're a seasoned entrepreneur and you've been around long enough but you haven't hit the secret sauce for the 10k months stick around because in this video i'm actually going to teach you how i hit 10k in just one day in my business on my day off Hi everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I am your host, Jennifer Marilla. This YouTube channel is for creators, coaches, and online service providers who are looking to grow their online business using social media. That's right up your alley. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button. If you're interested in how to make 10K in your business in one day while you're having a day off, then I hope you hit that thumbs up and tell me you're excited in the comments below because I'm gonna teach you exactly how this happened to me in my business and how it's happened to me multiple times, but really gonna walk you through the steps of how it happened to me most recently and just be totally transparent with you. So let's dive in and let's do this. Hey guys, what's up? Okay, so let's talk about creating consistency in your business and how to hit 10K days. Forget about months, days, all right? So this happened on August 19th, as you can see right here, where I had Stripe send me $10,000 to my bank account based on the day before, which happened actually August 18th, how I made $10,000. So I'm gonna walk you through the key steps that I've utilized in my business to have this consistency. So at this point in my business, I have hit about 20 to 30 to 40K months, even 50, even 70K months consistently in my business. And now while you're probably watching this and you're like, oh, this person's like talking and she's gloating and I'm not, I'm sharing this with you because I want you to know what's possible. When I was at your stage and what I mean your stage is if you're someone that's watching this, you're probably interested in learning how to get there, right? How to have those 10K days, like fuck months, days, right? And so these are the things that I've learned and I'm gonna walk you through this in this video on what you need to do today to start building that consistency so you can get there. And so the first and foremost thing I wanna to say to you is that this did not happen overnight. I have nurtured, I have built a community and I have built an actual business to get me to this place. So for someone who's just starting, please be kind with yourself and understand that while I'm gonna give you these tips, there are things that are gonna happen over time. This is a long game, this is not a quick win, happy success kind of thing. I think it's going to take some time because even though you can price a product at $10,000, you're still not gonna make the $10,000 right away if you haven't been nurturing an audience and you haven't been consistent. So this leads me to the first thing I wanna tell you that you need to do in order to start creating those 10K months. Be consistent. There are two things that need to happen every single day in your business sales and consistency. And so sales could be your content. Sales could be following up with warm leads. Sales could be following up with current clients to sell them into another program, right? Consistency means showing up even when you don't wanna show up. People need to start removing the emotional factor of showing up. I get that sometimes it's really hard to show up and I understand, especially when I was starting my business, how difficult it can be to show up consistently when you're not seeing the results. But the only way you start to see results in your business is if you show up consistently and you ignore put on your blinders is how I call it ignore the outside noise of what you think it should look like versus what it looks like so showing up consistently and having that plan of execution no matter what the result is without receiving the validation from the outside world what you're putting out is great or not because at the end of the day it really doesn't matter you're just showing up for the long-term game because eventually someone will buy from you right which allows me to talk about this you can sell a ten thousand dollar product but the chances of someone buying it today if they've never heard who you are what you have to offer and basically what your authority is in that space of based on the product that you're selling is likely is unlikely that person's actually going to buy because you haven't built that authority meaning i got that 10k sale or i've had a 10k sale because I've done all the work and consistency, the weeks, the days, the months before in order to build that authority in this space, in the online space, to get somebody to buy from me from that, okay? So in full transparency, that 10K came from somebody joining a mastermind and it actually came actually came from three people joining a mastermind. It came from somebody paying in full and then two people actually um, joining the mastermind and paying monthly retainers, right? And so I have a six month high level mastermind that takes people from zero to, actually that's not true, it takes people from two to 3K to consistent 10K months and I do that inside that container, right? So that's how I got somebody to basically give me a 10K in one day. Um, actually it wasn't one person, it was three people. And so I was actually on vacation, I was away for the weekend, my boyfriend came to visit and I was actually driving on my way up to a cabin um, in upstate New York 
uh, with my family and friends and that just like strolled in and it was really freaking nice. Okay. So that leads me to the next thing that you need to do in your business in order to see the consistency is have a product to sell. <laughs> just like I mentioned to you right now that that sale came from one product, but three people bought based on different payment plans, right? That's what you need to do in your business. I talk about this, about creating a product suite in this video. And so I definitely suggest you guys check it out here where I walk you through a client journey and how to do that for your business. But that is the most important thing, basing your products around something that is actually sustainable. So a lot of people come to me and they're like, hey, I have a one hour session and people can pay X amount. And I have another hour session and people get X amount. Or I have a 90 minute session and people can pay X amount. And what you're doing is you're creating a very a la carte type business model which means that your clients are still running your business and you're not seeing the consistency of income in your business. So that means that your business cannot be sustainable because every single month of income, your revenue stream is very up and down. So in order to shift that, you want to start creating packages based on what you can offer your ideal client that is meeting them at all their levels, right? So if you're a service provider, you wanna offer a low level offer, a mid level offer, an high level offer, and depending on how much you need to sell in that month in order to hit 10K, it makes it a lot easier for you, hit, for you to hit a 10K month and or a 10K day. So if you have a $10,000 product for a six month container and somebody pays in full, there is your 10K day. So that's just to give you an idea of what you need and to wrap it up nicely, consistency, sales, and having the right product. So those are the three things you need in order to hit a 10K day. You wanna have consistency not only in your content, but also in your sales process, right? Are you selling every single day? You're selling that one product every single day that is going to get your ideal client to purchase from you and potentially that product, which is our third thing, is 10k and or it could be two pro it could be one product that's five thousand dollars right so you're gonna be you can have one product that's five thousand dollars and you just need two clients in that day in order to do that right and so it's not a consistency just about the content but how are you following up how are you nurturing that relationship showing up when you don't want to show up removes the emotional attachment to your business a business is a business right like you need to do the damn thing that's the bottom line in order for you to have a sustainable business and getting to that place so I encourage you to do that. If this was great and you enjoyed this video, I want you to drop in the comments and let me know. If you're struggling to put together your product suite and your products and pricing, then I also want you to drop in the comments below and I'll create a video for that. Or you can check out my free masterclass on how to become a six-figure CEO. Again, this is a free masterclass. The link is in the description below and I will see you inside there. You wanna make sure you watch the complete masterclass because you actually have a chance to get a free six-figure business strategy call with me and you can do that inside that masterclass. All right, you guys, until next time, I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you subscribed, give me a thumbs up. And until next time, I'll see you guys soon. Have an amazing day. Take care, bye.